First introduced in 2.48 as a simple annotation tool, just like in several DCC apps, Grease Pencil has evolved with one of its remarkable leaps seen when Blender 2.8 was released in 2019. Grease Pencil 2.0 was born at the time, and this section of Blender has gone through the rigorous experiment of users, developers, and so on, making it one of the preferred sketch and 2D animation tools for most open source creators. From storyboarding to award winning shots, Grease Pencil has provided more functionality and brought more people to Blender as a fully functional 2D animation system than most sections of Blender. And with the announcement of Grease Pencil 3.0, which was confirmed earlier in the year, Blender 4.0 may be the first version of Blender to ship with Grease Pencil 3.0. The main focus for Grease Pencil 3.0 will be to have feature parity with old systems. Rather than adding new features, it is mostly a big refactoring of the entire Grease Pencil, as 3.0 is a full rewrite of the current implementation aiming to lay solid foundation for the next 10 plus years. And the goals to be achieved includes improved performance and memory usage with large amount of data, improve the architecture and API for future development, and open the doors for new features and tools. And speaking about new features and tools, here are a few things to look out for for 3.0. A rework timeline is definitely coming, there's going to be updates to the Python API, and layer groups, which of course offers artists the ability to group layers as this is part of the redesign of the new data structure. And this would allow for a good level of control over a few things like visibility, editability, onion skin, and more. And for the timeline, June to October is slated for contributions and bulk of refactoring, while we expect Grease Pencil 3.0 to be fully available and replace the existing system with the release of Blender 4.0 sometime in November 2023. Although this doesn't end here, as there is also a few features that are being looked at which was gathered within the survey that was done sometime in 2022. These might potentially make it to subsequent updates and release of Grease Pencil, but only time will tell and the folks behind the development of Grease Pencil would make that decision. So this is it. For those who would like to take a look at all of this, links to this is going to be in the description so do well to check it out. And of course, if you like this video or you like something from this, you can go ahead and give a like and don't forget to share with a friend. And I'd like to see you guys in the next one. Peace.